Okay, I'm going to do a tutorial on how to do an advanced search on eBay. For some reason, this just doesn't want to stay focused. I think my phone took a hit somewhere along the way. Anyways, when you're on the eBay page and you want to search something, you don't click on just search. Whoops, you click on advanced search. First, you click on the word advanced. That takes you to this page. It says advanced search. Then what you do is right here, you enter your item. Let's say you want to look up Disney collector plates. After you've done that, you don't, you don't go down here and click search, but you go down here and let's say I want to check them out. I click title and description. Then I click search. Now what's going to happen is any item online on eBay here that has the words Disney, plates, and collectors is going to come up. So then I get all these different plates coming up. Now beyond that, there's other ways to search. You could sort it. You could do time ending soonest newly listed, price and shipping lowest, price and shipping highest, price highest, distance nearest. Oftentimes I'll do ending soonest because let's face it, everybody bids the last five seconds of an auction anyway. So in a way, your best bet is to find out what's ending soonest. I could also, a lot of times I'll click lowest price price because everybody wants to get the best price right and then it'll separate things by their lowest price let's say you want to sell your Disney collector plates you go back to the advanced search page and now let's say I have a Disney plate I want to see how much they sold for so I click sold listings and then I click search again and what this is going to do, it's going to show me every plate that is sold in the last three months and how much it sold for. Here's a square collector plate that sold for $19. So this, and again, you could separate these all, you know, by, by all these different variables. You could sort it in different ways. So all you do is click on whichever one you want. Um, Let's say I want to just see the completed listings. So I click completed listings for those collector plates. Then again, I click search. And then this gives me, shows me all the auctions that have been completed. If the numbers are red, it means it didn't sell. Here's a Cinderella plate, $6, it didn't sell. Again, if the, if the price is red over here, it means it did not sell. All of these plates did not sell, sadly. I mean, look at this, $6. Unbelievable. If it's green like this, it means it's sold. Here's a Cinderella Castle Square Collector plate sold for $19. So this gives you an idea how to do advanced searches. There's so many ways. If anybody has questions, please hit me up and I'd be more than happy to help you. It's my nature. Good bidding to you and have a wonderful day.